So small update. I finally got the bearing shims for the turbo bench. So now it's finally assembled and I can get get the electronics on it and need to find some kind of motor to spin the shaft. I have a couple of motors but I need to test them how well they perform and that they are smooth enough for the turning so that they don't impose any interference for the signal but yeah need to check that out yeah I put put the swing on these L brackets so now the frame is sturdy and I can put some posts on here if I want to raise it and put a motor underneath underneath the frame so I can run this balancing system on that but yeah now there's shims between each of the bearings so the bolts and the frame don't wrap on the bearing and the action is very smooth but yeah there, there was just a small update on this one I'll get you guys some more updates when I get this thing running and I see what kind of results I get then I need to balance some shafts or a core assembly and just send it out for rebalancing for the purpose of seeing how well it is balanced after my after this and I can get some kind of reference point on how accurate this setup is going to be if it's accurate enough for what I'm going to use it as for building my own turbochargers I don't know I'm not going to do any any work for other people maybe for some friends if this is okay but no cost no customer work for now this is just this is just a hobby machine and I want to see if it's okay to do it like this balance the rotating assembly and then put it all together and just run it like it is but yeah now I can adjust the distance between these and I can I can balance everything I want from small shafts to turbo shafts and stuff but yeah if you have any comments put them down below subscribe if you want to I don't care if you don't but then you get all the updates if I have some but anyways you all be safe and have a nice day bye